Good morning, Hoosiers, and welcome to Paper News 24-7, brought to you today by Fourth Hawk Consulting, business efficiency specialists. Your local news in a very efficient three minutes or less starts right now. I'm Stu Clampett with today's top headlines. The Ben-Hur building turned into Crawfordsville's version of Cape Canaveral on Friday morning. A quasi launch pad was set up in front of the building, and everyone went about the final preparations in the moments before the final countdown. The plan was to take an aerial video and photography drone up to scan the building. Analysts would then be able to determine what kinds of repairs needed to be done to the building. It went like this. Huh. Well, Fourth Hawk Consulting decided to fly our drone, Hawkeye 1, on Friday as well, and that went like this. Give me a call, gentlemen. I'll be happy to get you some high-definition footage of your building, even in the wind. In other news, if you've ever wanted to be in a Netflix documentary, here's your chance. As an added bonus, you'll get to see a critically acclaimed comedy show. Tickets are on sale now for Knock 'em Dead Comedy at the Barefoot Burger on June 1st. All the details are in today's paper. That's your local news for today. Your forecast looks like this. Today, showers and thunderstorms are likely. It will be mostly cloudy with a high near 78 degrees. Tonight, we see showers and thunderstorms as well. It will be cloudy overnight with a low around 54. Sunday, that chance of rain continues with cloudy skies and a high near 62. Sunday night, there is still a chance of rain with mostly cloudy skies and a low dropping all the way down around 49. On Monday, it will be partly sunny with a high near 71 and an overnight low around 51. That's your local news and weather. Sports with Nick Wilson is up next. Hey there, sports fans. I'm Nick Wilson, and here's what you need to know today in Montgomery County sports. The Mounties took advantage of timely hitting, good pitching, and Mustang miscues to survive in advance, beating Fountain Central 6-4 in Friday's second semifinal game. The win improves the Mounties to 11-15 overall and will play Seeger on Monday in the sectional championship. With tensions mounting and hearts pumping, the Southmont Lady Mounties are in position to take a major championship and advance to the highest level of play. Southmont's next opponent has been set with the game slated to be played on June 2nd at 7 p.m. against the Squires of Manchester High School in the regional championship. Two of the best and most exciting baseball teams in the region will be going head-to-head -head on Monday. The battle will take place in the form of sectional 25 championship game between the Crawfordsville Athenians and their conference rivals, the Frankfurt Hot Dogs. And that was your three minutes of local news. For more information on these and other stories, click on our e-edition or pick up a print copy of the paper of Montgomery County. For the Paper News 24-7, I'm Nick Wilson.